One of the major problems that MacBook Pro owners are aware of is the butterfly keyboard. Now this keyboard is problematic because of the butterfly mechanism where dust or other small particles can get stuck underneath the keys and after some time can render the key useless. The key can get stuck and we used to call this sticky keys. The shallow travel as well was one of the problems and this keyboard felt dull. It did not give you this good experience in typing. And today I was reading something very interesting on The Verge. It says, the article says, Apple is reportedly giving up on its controversial MacBook keyboard. And that is amazing. Well, fingers crossed. We can finally say that at some point Apple will finally give up on their butterfly keyboard. Now, the article says that Apple is planning to ditch the controversial butterfly keyboard used in the MacBook since 2015 according to a new report from analyst Ming-Chi. Analyst Ming-Chi is a famous analyst and usually his predictions are pretty accurate about Apple plans and Apple products. So that report says that Apple will reportedly move to a new scissor switch design, thank God, which will use glass fiber to reinforce its keys. Now one of the things I hate about the MacBook Pro is the shallow key travel. It does not give you a good typing experience. And once they finally make the switch to the scissor switch design, I think a lot of people are going to be relieved. Keyboards like this give you a premium typing feel. And one of the best keyboards that I've actually seen and felt on a laptop was the Lenovo ThinkPad X1 Carbon. Now the report cites a couple of different reasons why Apple is switching keyboard designs as well as being more durable thanks to the glass fiber reinforcement. The report says that the new keyboard could improve the typing experience by offering longer key travel. Finally, longer key travel. That's exactly what we've been waiting for. Now, unfortunately, the report suggests that the new keyboard won't make it into this year's rumored 16-inch 16 16 MacBook Pro, which is expected to be announced this September. Now, if this report is true, my suggestion would be to hold off your purchase until 2020. So if you have the 2017, 2018, or just like me, the 2016 model, which all have the same butterfly mechanism problem, I think it's better to wait until the 2020 model is released, unfortunately, because just like the report says, the new keyboard won't make it into this year's rumored MacBook Pro. So wait until 2020, that's my advice, so that you can get the best experience possible when it comes to the butterfly keyboard. Scissor keyboard. Please subscribe to my channel if you like this video and share it with your friends. Thank you.